guys welcome to my channel Taquise Beauty Tutorials if you haven't yet make sure you subscribe to my channel it really helps and also give this video a big thumbs up if you like this look okay go in a real nice detailed look all right and I think you can pretty much pull this off if you're going to work if you just need something you know this is a real quick simple look okay um, I only use one palette and that palette was my brat my brat palette one of my faves so if you guys want to see how i got this look and you try to achieve this at your home or you want your makeup artist to pull it off keep watching this video you'll get this look bye i hope you guys like this video make sure you like this video make sure you subscribe okay subscribe help me grow i'm growing i'm growing but i am I would like to grow a little bit more as always thank you for everyone who supports my channel i see you guys in my next video enjoy the video bye hello guys welcome back to my channel i'm not gonna talk much now um i'm doing a makeup look okay got some business to take care of this morning and i need to be cute i gotta be cute this afternoon okay so um yeah i'm gonna talk through but I am gonna talk a little bit to you guys right now not much all right I exfoliate my lips using my um, lip scrub and it's so 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 nice I love my lip scrub um I got a, a lot of new makeup for Christmas um, I'm trying to ram beauty um, concealer and I actually got a little bit of a sample here before I open my new one. I actually got two new ones. Girl, baby. So I'm going to use this Ram um, Beauty Concealer. Ooh, it's kind of... I got my concealer here that I'm going to be using. And um, I actually have a full size. So I'm going to give you guys a full makeup look, a full face. Would that be alright with y'all? If I give you a full makeup tomorrow, girl. So right now, okay. So what I'm gonna do right now is I need to prime my face. So I'm gonna use this NYX, this NYX um, primer. It's really nice. Um, it helps, you know, it helps your face like plump right back. It says. And it has like electric lights in it. It's really nice for hydration of the skin. And it does help with the foundation. When I use this product with some foundations that I use with it, it allows the foundation to like dry, dry really fast. I don't know why. But <laughs> and it's really nice if you got sensitive skin because it doesn't bother me at all. It smells nice. So guys, you know I go to my brows before anything. I'm just going to put this foundation like. And I'm just going to like get that. get Maybe they help me with. Ooh, it matches. So, I'm going to start with my brows before anything. What we're about to do is jump into the Morphe um, brow pencil. It's like a mechanical pencil. It's a mechanical um, brow, and it's um, chocolate mousse. I like this color. It's it's like a dark. It's really dark enough, and it really matches with my um, brow. So this is actually a Christmas gift. Um, you know I love brows. You know gotta have brows. So the color that you guys see on there. It's actually how it really looks. It's really nice and chocolate. It's a nice color or whatnot. And I like the way it's so smooth and it does not like, it does not smudge. It's so smooth, you know, and it just make, you know, it's, it's so silk. It just make everything like when you put it on your applying this product on your brows, it just glide. So this is a wonderful 
brow product for beginners and you know if you just like something that actually works it comes with a spoolie on the end and it really helps to kind of like blend the product in you know so you won't use so much product and this is the brow product here the pencil side um very smooth and nice i really like this product and you guys gonna see how easy it is for me to glide this morphe um brow product on it's really nice you can count you can go to or to to get this or actually go into the morphe store you know to get this product it's worth it okay i don't know how much it costs because like i said it was a christmas gift I, th I think it's a wonderful product. I was able to get through with my brows really quickly. And um, just to let you guys know, I will be using Anastasia Brow Product. No, Anastasia Foundation. I'm using Morphe Brow Product. And I'm going to use Anastasia Foundation, which is a wonderful foundation. Now, if you guys see how smooth this pencil is like gliding through the brows, easy for me to make the lines just create what I want to create in this brow and I like that now I do need to arch my brows because they're not the best so yeah I take the spoolie on the end and just blend the product in pull the product through the brow so I won't have to add any more product now the next step I'm gonna be sharing with you showing you guys how I shape my brows using the concealer and I'm using the Ram, um, the um, Ram, Rim Beauty, Ram Beauty um, concealer, and it's really thick. It's a thick, thick product, and it it really did a great job. But the thing is, I don't like using too much thick products on my brows, you know, because you know, the thick. I mean, it, the coverage of this concealer. It's really nice if you have like any kind of discoloration. If you have anything you're trying to cover up, this um, concealer from Ram Beauty, I'm not sure if you used to call it Ram or Ram Beauty. It's really nice. It's a nice product. It's really nice. I mean, it's like a dressing, you know, but it's really thick and a little bit goes a long way. And you need to be careful. Make sure you blend it in well because, like I said, if you don't, it's thick enough, you know, and you don't want people, like, seeing it, you know, all up in your face. Like, oh, look how silly. How did you do your brows, you know? So, yeah, I do recommend thinner layers of product, like thinner products, thinner concealers for your brows. It really helps you get through quickly. But I still like this on my brows. It's really nice. Um... Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Oh, yes, I recommend the Ram Beauty um, product on the top of the brow. So nice. Oh, it, it, it cut my brow so nice. I like the way that product is. And, you know, you get you a nice size brush to make sure you balance out that product. And I actually went into the Anastasia brow freeze to pull my brows up and then I went into <laughs> I went into the Anastasia um brow um uh I think I don't I don't know the um, the actual like manual is but it's like um it's like brow gel but it's like it's like um it's a colored brow gel it says tinted brow gel Anastasia um, and this is the color granite. Oh my God. When I tell you, when I put this brow product on, it went like perfect with the Morphe color. And it just made my brows look thicker, you know. And the brow, um, the tinted product, brow gel, helps, you know, bring the illusion of hair. Like, um, if you're not really good at, you know, drawing your brows, you can just get this um, tinted brow gel and make sure it's dark like a color the same color your brows and you just pull it up or whatnot and that makes your brows look thicker fuller and it's easy to finish it up too 
then you just go into the steps that I'm going into with the concealer and shaping your brows. You can do this. Now, guys, brows are really important to me. You know, I really like to make sure my brows look nice. I don't like concealer being on the hairs, you know. So I went into that um, Anastasia Brow Freeze, one of my favorite products. I tell you guys about Got another one for Christmas. I'm so excited about that. So I went into that product and kind of just made everything smooth, you know. Then I dived into um, my eyeshadow primer by Too Faced. So right now I'm diving into the Anastasia Foundation. And I really, this is my first time ever using this foundation. At first, when I first saw it, when it first came out, um, I think it was like um, maybe two years ago, maybe. I don't remember. But I was kind of afraid of it because I'm like, I like coverage. And it was like too sheer for me. But um, it's, it's, it's really nice, easy to really like blend into the skin. My skin actually liked it. This, and I like this color too, you know. And I can kind of go with whatever colors I want. And I kind of make it blend into my skin, you know. Because it's, it's like, you know, when I do my makeup, I like to really do my makeup. So I make sure that concealer is blend in from my brows and then I take that concealer I'm taking that ram concealer again and I am putting it into the center putting it underneath my eye in the crease and I'm tapping it in and I notice that this product does not sit in the crease it really looks nice um, this is like more a full coverage concealer really nice if you're like on movie sets and you're looking for something for coverage, you know, it's really nice. If you're looking for something for coverage, okay, you're going to be on camera and you want to make sure you get the best out of the concealer, Ram Beauty is really a nice concealer, and I really like it. So I got a new product for Christmas, Fendi Beauty. You know, I like her um, setting powder, and I got butter. Butter is my favorite. Really like this product. So I go in and I set it with um the fendi beauty product so i'm gonna allow the product to sit you know and y'all know that i get crazy when i'm putting my powder on it ain't how you put it on it's what you do when you take it off it's how you remove it so yeah i'm going ahead and just putting the powder on or whatnot the powder really the setting powder really helps um the face not stain from the eyeshadow okay the eyeshadow won't, you know, really stain. You know, you got to redo it. Diving into my Brat palette. Y'all know I love my Brat's palette. So, yeah, and I'm diving into, like, this pink color. I'm, I can't really tell you guys what I'm in. You just got to know that I'm in this palette here. Because I, I, I don't think I show you guys the color that I'm using. And I'm so sorry for that. Yeah. I was just trying to get through because normally when I do talk-throughs, I realized that I can finish up quickly, you know, and I can still go by my day and be able to do whatever I need to do. Like I had a meeting to go to and I wanted my makeup to be really, really nice. Yeah, I like, I like, I like to, you know, and I love this palette, guys. It's so pigmented and nice. It's pretty. I like the breasts. I like anything that brings me back to thinking when I was a kid, my mom wouldn't allow me to have the Bratz dolls. She said they looked kind of scary, the heads were big. But she was a fan of Barbie, so I had a lot of Barbie. So I was really happy when I found those Barbie flat irons at Orta. Orta really have great products. Sometimes the people who work there are not really friendly. But for the most part, I'm just praying and hope that a change will come. Because I like to spend a lot of money at Orta. Um, I was working at Sally's and um, I didn't really care for it because I, I, I'm an Orta fan and I like to spend my money in Orta. I like to shop at Orta because they have a lot of things that I want. It's a one-stop shop and I like that. I even like going to Sephora, but I don't really get a chance to go to Sephora because I like Orta so, so much. And sometimes I get a chance to stop at the beauty supply store and try some of their products, you know. But I don't get a chance to do that much either. 
So I'm diving into the NYX Professional um, uh, Epic Liner. I love it. I need new liners. I need more liners, more eyeliners. Really bad. And this is one of my favorite because it's like a pen that you can just get through with whatever. You know, you can go ahead and finish it. And then I got this new mascara that I like from Urban Decay. It's really, really good. This, this mascara is really nice. It makes the lashes look thick and you don't even need eyelashes with this and I'm, I'm a living proof I tell you this freaking um mascara girl you know I need to have a good mascara and let me tell you it does not irritate my eyes so I know that it's hyperallergenic and that is another A plus for me I also want to take the time out and say because it's a lot of videos that I got on Orta reviews and the way they treat people you know um like my friend did a video on in a hostile environment i allowed her to do it on my channel and i took some losses from that helping her and i don't mind that that's okay people opinion are their opinion but i'm for what's right i would love to work at Orta one day i would love to you know it's it's very fun to work in a place where you like to shop where you said <laughs> you know but i would probably spend my whole check but anyway um yeah I just want to let you guys know that because I, I took some losses from that video. I don't mind it because as long as the point got across and my friend got some help, hey, but I'm going to keep you guys updated if you guys know what video I'm talking about. Uh, I will link it so you guys to know. And um, I just, I just, I, I'm going to, we're going to keep you updated. You know, um, she told me things have are getting better. So, you know, that, that's the good part, you know, but anyway. Orta is like a great job I would like to have, but you know, they they don't like me, you know, and I don't know why. But hey, um, some of them, not all of them, are like that. But I've tried John Creek, I've tried Buford, you know. John Creek told me how good I was and how they would like to make me a manager or whatever. But she was trying to get me to become a freelancer for actually like um. I think it's called, um, I, I really can't remember that um, company, Pure. And I was like, I don't even know much about that brand. You know, I would really like to work in the store. I wanted, I applied for, you know, Mac, you know, um, but I didn't get the job. I don't know why, you know. Sometimes you got to take your losses. In 2022, I realized that, you know, sometimes it's not, it's not about you. It's about the people. You know, it, you're, it's nothing wrong with you. It's just that, you know, some people just, you know, they, they want to hire who they want to hire. And you just got to let that be. You know, in 2022, I've learned that sometimes you just got to understand that just because they didn't pick you, it doesn't mean that you wasn't good enough. It's their problem. You know, and I'm, I'm learning that. So you guys see that um, I'm removing this powder. Um, now, if you, the longer you let that set, it's going to be um, kind of difficult to remove, but you got to blend with all your life. Blend with all your life, honey. And one of the things I want to point out to you guys, you see how nice those, my, do you see how nice that eyeshadow is? Do you see how nice my lashes are? And I don't have falsies in yet. Now you guys know I have to tell you, if you're not subscribed to my channel, I hope that this video prompt you to do so. I hope you like what you see. And I really hope I'm explaining everything to the best of my knowledge to help you, you know, um, especially if you, you know, can't get a makeup artist at a time and you want to go ahead and, you know, you need some great products to have just in case. Now, as you guys see, I'm taking my sponge, blending everything in. You know, I like to go back in my sponge and make sure I kind of like you know remove like any kind of lines make sure that powder is pushed into my skin so it won't be too harsh because anytime you set you know and you use a lighter color it's gonna get kind of harsh for you yeah but um now i'm applying my lashes i love my lashes all right so i use i like lashes that last for a while because i don't really like to continue to constantly buy lashes I like to use my lashes at least for a month or two. The same lashes. That's just the way it go, okay? And, and, and if it gets, I like to be able to 
remove the glue and you know I like lashes that last a long time I like nice quality lashes I love nice quality lashes and um, when my website come back up you guys if you see my lashes you should buy them because I really like quali quality I like quality quality like I don't like for people to waste money I like for you to buy great products like my skincare is amazing for like acne prone skin and you when my website come up when I'm done with you know replenishing my products and it's a lot going on girl this 20 this the, the ending of 2022 became really rough for me you know but oh my god you don't know how how much I've learned and I'm grateful I'm grateful you know um I'm grateful that I ain't give up on myself you know how big that is to not give up on yourself in a situation in places where you should have but you didn't yeah so you mm -hmm. <laughs> So now guys, setting my face using the Urban Decay um, product all nighter. I like the setting spray, it's really nice. So then I like to take my sponge and go in and kind of tap that product in. Now sometimes I have to do a little extra damage for my brow, for my lashes and whatnot because you need to make sure they on. But however, sometimes you try to be perfect and then you don't get it the way you want it. But hey, it is what it is, you know. But however, I put a little mascara on just in case I didn't tighten them up real good. But I wanted them to be tightened up real good, but I just couldn't get it right. I don't know. Maybe I got in a hurry or whatnot, but it did turn. This is absolutely a beautiful look. I'm very impressed with this look. So going to the Anastasia a uh, um, glow palette and um, I just go in and I like you know um, put little highlights in my little powerpoint area that when a light hit I kind of like glitter because I like to glitter I like for my skin to look a little wet yeah this look turned out so nice I was really happy with it um, yeah I was really happy with this look guys Sometimes you can just take a little liner and just kind of put in between the lashes and boom, there you go. But however, I wasn't even thinking about that. I was trying to get out the door. But anyway, dived into, I put a mold on my face and I used the Anastasia um, um, lipstick. And I can't remember the name of that lipstick. Um, but however, it's one of my favorite lipsticks. I really like it a lot. Um... So yeah, I got this look by uh, doing what I showed you. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really enjoyed making it for you. Um, until we meet again, I will see you guys in my next video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel so you can continue to see videos that I do. Guys, please subscribe to the channel if you like this video, if you were, if you appreciate this video. It will mean a lot to me to see you again because I'm always here for you. You know, um, I got plenty makeup videos you guys can check out. And I just link a few um, in the video so you guys to see. See you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.